it is. Yeah, forget that. There you go. Oh, no. No, no. Yeah. You dumbass. Listen. 12 up for the balls. Come in, come on. Problem. I'm all problem. The highs and lows, right? You'll probably not film this as well. I'm really happy you to sit and watch me winning, winning, winning. It's day one of the Goodwood trip and we're all packed up and ready to go with the team proudly ready to show off all their hard work Well, there's a thing Building the GTR V3.0 But hang on a minute, this isn't very SB Motorsport And Goodwood's in July, they're all wearing coats And that's not even... That's the Navara! Oh, this has got to be the wrong tape Hang on, sorry about this let me just get the right. Ah, here it is. Goodwood. Right, here we go. Day one of the Goodwood trip, and the team are under pressure. Last minute bullshit. Everyone's sleeping, grumpy. No one's had much sleep. Sam lists what's left to be done on the car. Uh, everything. Because I'm the only one which does shit. <laughs> Bags is that's my fault. You should have done it weeks ago. Well, if you would have come to work yesterday, you'd be alright, wouldn't it? It's true. If Ian had come to work yesterday, he could have done the jigsawing, hammering, <coughs> grinding, drilling. But alas, it's day one of the Goodwood trip, and Ian is welding at like six in the morning. And where's Bagsy? Bagsy's still in bed. He's sleeping. He had a couple of hours sleep last night, bless him. I need to lay down. He falls asleep here. Wake me up, wake me up when it's good wood. But there's no time to sleep. There's air ducts to install, the headlights don't work, and there's the small matter that the GTR is in the habit of setting fire to itself. Making a little support from here. So what happens, it gets hot and it goes down and then it melts the bumper, so I'm just putting a little bit of preload on it. The team should have been on the road three hours ago. Why did I do this? And the stress is starting to show. But we're sure they'll figure it out. Anything I know, I'll learn off YouTube. So Bags, you learn how to drift. I wonder if Bags is going to buy breakfast when he gets here. Look at the crap coming out of that one. Christ! There's no bulbs in it either. No bulb in that one. With the new Liberty Walk body kit protected from flames, Sam dials in the ST suspension to protect it from the ground. The hill climb's not a race circuit where it's going to have perfect tarmac, so we might have a few like, little lumps and bumps and stuff in the road, so we might end up ruining the kit. So we're just going to raise it up 20 mil just to you know make sure the kit makes it through the weekend. People on the internet, I don't agree with raising cars. It's just, it's my job. I think we should slam it and send it, smash the kit off it. Just as the team seem to be making some progress, things take a turn for the worst. Jack. An old enemy arrives in the shape of Kevin Quinn. He proceeds to fiddle, tamper, peer at things, and awkwardly stand about deploying mind games. But the team take this behaviour in their stride and proceed to load up ahead of what's set to be the greatest event of the summer. at Goodwood Racecourse. I am very excited to see Goodwood Festival of Speed signs. Uh, Festival of Speed is probably the best event of the season. I'm just glad that things are, you know, really are starting to get back to normal now. You know, there's people going to be there, there's people coming from, you know, all around the world as well. So, yeah, things are starting to look good. Bagsy sure loves Goodwood, and they love him too. So much so, they've rolled out the red carpet. Jesus Christ almighty. Having a, a laugh. 
How am I meant to get through here? I'm not going to get through there. <laughs> yeah, I'm alright. It is like the creme de la creme, isn't it? This yeah, is the flint wall that is extremely scary going around in a drift car when you're looking at it. It's like a hexagon. Where we are? Yeah, along here. Where? Here on the left. Where? Oh, right, we've got our names. Do you want to move? Because we're here first, we've probably got the luxury of reorganising this slightly. We should probably not film this as well. I've been really happy you to sit and watch me win again and win again and win again. I know it's probably getting on me and when I'm sending them. So if I ever win again, it's nobody the minimum. I didn't have to sell my soul. As the team take up their position, the GTR's ride height is still playing on Sam's mind. Too high. There's only a certain highness of acceptability. There's a point of where you become too high, and that's it, it's not acceptable. In public anyway. Who the best in this thing? Tell them, yeah, that's me. Tell them. Now, if that ain't a flex, I don't know what a flex is. Sam's been appointed on-site workshop manager. Skills. And it's a role he intends to make his own. Give him disciplinary. Why? Because people ain't sweeping the floors. And as workshop manager, I need to know, make sure people are sweeping floors. What started off as a joke has actually become reality, you know. It's like they say, isn't it? If you've got a dream that's big enough and you just dream it hard enough, it comes true. I had dreams are pretty big and hard. Chilling at the top. Well, after a super long day filled with stress and last minute panic, the team can relax in the knowledge they've made it to Goodwood, they've claimed their space in the pits, and they can look forward to a fantastic event and get an early night. At least that's what should have happened. Can we go for a drive? No. But we're going to be quiet. Well, we'll be somewhat quiet. experience. <laughs> Day two and the team are getting everything presentable and ship shape, ready to meet the Goodwood public. This morning when I woke up I had a bad dream. Yeah, the car broke and we, and we missed the ball. I don't know why, it's just that's what my dream was last night. Could Bagsy's dream be a premonition of a nightmare to come? Nah, it'll be fine. Today is kind of a shakedown for us. We're going up the hill only once practicing for the drift Kana section. Anyway, yeah, right. oh, right. donuts, donuts. Yep. Meeting with the organizers and the rest of the drivers and look to the track. It seems all the drivers make sense of the track in their own way. Passenger side first, yeah. and then transition into parts of But luckily, George is on hand. All the way around. But it is literally yeah. Back to where we've gone past. It's not and water. once more, just to be clear. So we come in, yeah, we're drifting like around. And then park. Just and then park. park. That's yeah. Well, that's cleared that up. And we're with the GTR V3. We are GTR 3.0. It's just up to me now to get it to the top of the hill and back down again in one piece. Yeah, because she's beautiful. It does just seem like. Yeah, I feel that looks like a step. You know, please, please don't. Step. How have we ended up scratching this already? Hmm? I want to make sure we took loads of photos of it. So get loads of video of it now, loads of photos of it now just in case something happens. A good way to ensure nothing happens is to get that wheel alignment sorted. This is me doing your alignment. Get out there for the bit. Right, the bit. Let me 
checking my windows and then I'll take your windows. Fuck me. Oh, yes. Yes. yes, clean my windows. It's an exchange in services. Oh, you're not. <laughs> you're not <cleaning> <laughs> I, I need him to do my live <laughs> That's it, mate. Silly bit of the wipers. Oh, oh. serious. <laughs> <laughs> Even I do that. <laughs> we, we got a time schedule we got to keep. Well, hurry up and do my alignment, mate. Well, while Martin does his magic, there's just time to visit KN. With the alignment sorted and the windows cleaned, it's all systems go. Goodwood Festival speed day one, first run up the hill, uh, excited and nervous at the same time, brand new car, not driven it since we built it, so fingers crossed, fingers crossed everything goes according to plan. Feel like I'm at the tip of the top of my game, looking down at the rafters, I had to sun these boys, can't leave them blasters, a lot of tools, just a little bit of actress, I don't fall for it, I'm perfect to all your tactics, yeah, so try again, it's time to take a vitamin, yeah, and vitamin, welcome to the lion's den, and I'm a fossil, big boss, and charge up, come in there like a pool, you see me raising the stock up, uh, yeah. So baby, you gonna need some patience. I already won. Now I'm just making. I'm so relieved we made it at least the first run without hurting the car. So. Well, when the maiden voyage goes without a hitch, you give her a drink to celebrate and take her out somewhere nice, and give her some attention. Beautiful day at Goodwood with just some minor engine concerns. Uh, the car got a misfire. I'm just trying to figure out what it is. So we checked the, we found one plug lead that failed and uh, we hope that that fixes it. Meanwhile, Bagsy takes a slightly more optimistic view. We had a slight misfire yesterday, but yeah, everything's good now. So yeah, looking forward to it. Holding grid at the minute, uh, this is where we wait to get our turn to go up the hill. Uh, we've been asked to join the highlights batch, so we're in the highlights batch now. Then we go up for drift car and practice. Just incredibly awesome to be back here and seeing so many amazing cars and awesome to see so many people. Don't worry about drifting flint wall. Actually, we're all right. It's just some of the other guys who haven't been here before. The only thing to watch out for is you know the first left turn? Fall off of Morgan. Under the bridge, yeah. it goes left. Yeah. It's off camber. Well, with the advice dished out, it's time to hit the track for a full run in anger.
pits, Bob doesn't like the look of the oil pressure. And when Bagsy returns, the engines shut off and the GTR coasts back into the pit. Something isn't right. But this doesn't look like teething problems. Looks like something much more serious. Fuck! Say, so, uh, rattled the bottom end. I don't understand how, it's a brand new fucking bottom end. Really? Yeah, I know. Fearing the worst, the team rush to diagnose the issue. Yeah, I know. Sam? Don't stop. We need to pull the locks and have a look. It'll oh, it stop logging again. Whatever, whatever's happening is not going to get any worse if I switch it on for a second. Do you think? Uh, no. Like, just be ready to turn it off. And I just don't want to hear it. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's a story of our lives. So, so the sooner we know, the sooner I can go and get the PS13 and come back. So. Shut the bonnet, put the fan on. Shit. Fuck it. Just sucks. So much time and effort has gone into this car over the last six months, and yeah, it's just gutting for everybody, really. Me, team, everybody's just, yeah, a bit guided now after not being able to continue driving it, but it is what it is. The, uh, the team want to rip it apart and try and fix it overnight, but I'm not fucking another car up. Because we'll have more work next week trying to get ready for UKDC or whatever we decide to do. I know, I know, we'll just put this on display and we'll just worry about We've got one car that works, let's just leave one car that works working. Put this thing on display and just call it a day with this thing. Same shit, different day, innit? And despite the team's inner turmoil... Hi guys, sorry. Having a good day? Yeah, not too bad, bro. You guys having a good day? The fans still get the bagsy they came to me. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like a sticker? Yeah, I'll let you have two. It is what it is. You just gotta smile and wave and you know, keep your chin up and remember that, you know, this is you know, this is a luxury. I am disappointed, I am sad, but at the, at the same time I'm at Goodwood Festival Speed driving a Nissan GTR, so you know, highs and lows, right? Same fuel, it's the same everything else. Just need rules and tyres. But yeah, go and get the van and trailer ready. And we'll go. Just go as quick as you can, see if we can make it. The, the next run's at three, isn't it? The next run's at five, and with Bagsy's top team on it, there's every chance we'll be racing by tea time. The flashy Yoki, the flashy Yoki. It's sturdy, sturdy. Dead as you fuck. Flashy as well. Distinct on that as well. Yeah, see, see, see how the lights came on? Oh, there, yeah, try now. Now, see how. Fuck me in The GTR's fucked, and so's the Gator. Walk uphill. <laughs> that was fun. It wasn't. Jump in, come on! You're an absolute legend. So we're currently going up to the hill. Unfortunately, our van's blocked in, so we're going to take uh, Martin Richards' van. He's kindly lent it to us, so we're going to commandeer that. But also, on the way down, we've uh, commandeered a ride from this lovely um, Goodwood employee. We should get back to the workshop at around 1, I think it is. 158. Essentially, re-lock pack for Goodwood in this van, then drive back to Goodwood. Meanwhile, back at Goodwood, a nervous wait for Bagsy. So as senior crew chief and spiritual advisor, as we all know, motorsport can be very stressful. So I like to take Steve away from the situation. It's great to take a breath and soak up the vibes. Okay. 
it's really important for Bagsy to keep on top of his nutrition. So his physique is good. As we know, motorsport is about getting the right look and presentation. Legit, I reckon you should definitely wear that. How much to wear that for the rest of the weekend? I reckon that's going to make my head hot. Maybe he's born with it. Maybe it's family. <laughs> what a pair of goons. Are you, are, you, are you nearly at the workshop? I want to get the skin. Oh shit. Okay, mate, fingers crossed. See you soon. Yeah, we're going to watch the rest of the guys go out. How are you finding it? Sad. Stephen's sad. 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 sad emoji. Still on our way. We're just taking a quick nap, as you've seen uh, in previous clips, and yeah, we're probably half hour away now, I'd say. Hello. 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 It's not him calling. It's him calling. So as long as we unlo unload the car up quick and that and get going, we should be there in time. Do you think we're going to make it, Sam? Yeah, we'll make it. Courtship. Last minute. Panic. Pandemonium. The team need to use the trailer that Ian's car lives on, so they approach it in the most respectful way they know how. Fucking Ian's a piece of shit. Ian, you need to scrap this year. That's what you need to do. This is scrap life. John, look at the state of this thing. Oh, 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 oh. What? Door's coming out. Huh? Fucking door's not even bolted on. With time running out, stress really starts to affect the team. No, no, like, we don't have time to stop, that's what I'm saying. Like, we're getting back for the last demo run. You know what I was doing? So what the fuck were you doing? Yeah, Locating it, you dumbass. Well, listen, calm down, Jim. Don't get aggressive, all right? Me. Don't keep on asking then. Huh? What are you doing, Jim? What are you doing? I'm not frustrated. Yes, I just want to get going. Yeah, I do too. But, right, how are we getting it off? Fucking drag it. Just hook it up to something, and while he drives the trailer forward, let it. Hopefully, it falls off and flips and crushes, and then he have to scrap it. Meanwhile, back at Goodwood. Hello, mate. Hello. So the plan is... Uh, you know. want to bring him with us, yeah? We ain't got a fucking clue. Whatever we're doing, we don't have much time. I know, I know. Come on, man. Back to Goodwood, and hopefully, we can make it back in time for the last session of the day so Steve can actually get out and drive a lap today. We'll see if we can get there in time. It's looking very, very tight at the minute. So we've got an hour it. to do an hour and a half drive. Yeah. Bah, 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 bah. How's yeah. it go? I know, it's a V8 and it's just. Oh, 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 o
so Adam conducts an investigation. Why was you so long on your road trip? I'm so sorry. I'm so well, sorry. you went at nine o'clock this morning and you got back at half past six. Well, there's always tomorrow. Goodwood Festival Speed, day three. The wet edition. <laughs> PS13 has arrived. I feel a lot more comfortable driving this car in the rain at the moment and I can be a little bit more competitive in Drift Kana. So uh, PS13 is now here and we're going to leave the lovely GTR version 3 Liberty Walk body kitted GTR on display. That's right, we're putting the problems with the GTR firmly behind us Focusing on the PS13, it's time to get competitive and show the rest of the pack just how it's done. I'm looking forward to going up the hill. Apparently the first half of the track is dry and apparently the second half of the track is uh, wet. It's been raining or maybe even still raining up the top of the hill. So it's definitely going to be an interesting one and uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. for a spot of civilised conversation at the Goodwood Drivers Club. Unfortunately, they didn't get the message that we've put the GTR issues behind us. It's worth noting you had to switch your car this weekend. I mean, I don't really see why we need to bring that up, but <laughs> I decided to uh, buy a Nissan Navara and try and fit it all in there and build the world's first Nissan Navara R. And uh, yeah, about I think we're about 18 months into the project at the minute and hopefully we'll have it done before November. Happy days. Cheers mate. Well, amidst all this opulent regal excellence, it's almost time for the ball. But what about that bad dream? This morning when I woke up I had a bad dream. Yeah, the car broke and we, and we missed the ball. Would young Bagsy make it to the ball? Yeah, he made it. However, at the stroke of midnight, his carriage and footman was tragically stolen. Welcome to Bagsy's vlog. I'm in the back seat of someone that thinks they're Colin McRae, but is obviously not quite as talented. And unfortunately, Bagsy got left behind because uh, I had to go to a motorhome to uh, drink more beer before we go up uh, this amazing Goodwood Hill. Tomorrow is going to be absolutely epic. If you post this, I will kill you. <laughs> All right, let's go. Day four, Goodwood Festival of Speed. The night after the ball. What an amazing night we had. Driftwood. Driftwood? I forget now. 
<laughs> Jesus. Feeling a little bit rough this morning, however, super excited about going up the hill this morning. It's right back to business for the final drift, Karna. The crowds need to see a winner, and Banksy is studying the competition in a bid to boost his chances. Today is the day to pull the win out the bag, and while some drivers will be happy, yeah, that's what we're talking about. Some will hit that final stop box with finesse. And for others, it'll be a day of dismal attrition. And Banksy doesn't mind taking a few knocks along the way, as long as he makes it to the top. Keeping cool after everything the team's been through, perhaps the team can avoid the fate of the others and maybe, just maybe, they can land perfectly in that box and take the win. Maybe next year. It's all in good spirit, though. At least they've stopped talking about the problems with the GTR. Well, at least Kevin Quinn didn't rear his head again. The Drift Kana champion in the Nissan Silvia S15 was Kevin Quinn. Woo! What is special about Goodwood? Bagsy. That's it? Yeah. But, good, but Bagsy's at all the events you go to. So what, what's special about Goodwood? It's Bagsy. What's the best thing that's happened at this event? Bagsy being here. Looking forward to going home, are you going to miss Goodwood? Going to miss Bagsy. We're representing drifting here on probably one of the most famous hill climbs in the world. Everybody who is anybody would love to drive up here, uh, I mean let alone drift. <laughs> Sending it out there flat out, round the bends, throwing some donuts outside the house is just incredible. You just destroy tyres and everyone just goes mad for it. <laughs> Thanks for joining us here at Goodwood Festival of Speed. Keep an eye out for the next episode of Behind the Drift. Wow! Look at the rear. Oh! Wow. With that cream, baby. Fuck right off, the Perry is fuck off. <laughs>